What I want to show you right now is what happened here over the weekend. There was a leak here from the hot water tank that caused some damage here in this closet, which is here in the office. If you don't know what this black stuff is, this is mold. And it grew on the walls around here, also around the hot water tank around here. There's some right here and also grew on the other walls over here too. Um, yeah, you can see right here. Yes, this is mold by the way everyone. Um, it was really bad here a couple days ago, but it's not that bad now. It's pretty much dried up. And you can see here that uh, it's caused a lot of water damage here. But everything in this closet has to be replaced. The walls here, you know, around this area right here where the mold's at, around the hot water tank where it's at, even around here, in parts of this place right here. You can probably see, yes, this is mold right here, and there's some right here too. Now, some of you are asking how this happened. It was a cause of a leak here from the hot water tank right here. This pipe right here was the one that caused the leak. And some PVC piping, you can see right here, is pretty much just degrading right now. It has to be replaced too, and I think this little other pipe here is going to have to be replaced as well. It just looks bad in here. And I don't know what else I, what else I can tell you about this, but the uh, hot water tank uh, somehow just leaked and just caused a lot of damage here. There was some stuff here in this closet that only on the floor got waterlogged in the worst way and had to be thrown, thrown away in the garbage. Actually, it's in the uh, utility trailer. It has to be hauled off to the dump. So, the walls here, from this part right here, around the hot water tank, even around here, maybe the floor here, are all going to have to be replaced. They're going to have to be taken out. So it's going to be taking a lot of time and money in order to do this, because my folks right now, money is a little bit tight for them right now. They just can't afford to... Uh, do a lot of things or any other home improvement projects because of bills they have to pay off. Um, this is a home that they've had for 15 years and this is the first time that uh, something like this had happened. So this is another headache that they're going to have to fix and I don't know what else we can do about it. Homeowners insurance cannot cover this. Um, they're homeowners. Yeah, their homeowners insurance can't cover this. Um, it's just going to have to be done on their own. So, you can see right here. And it's just really bad. Well, I wanted to show you what this looks like. And I couldn't even go come near this stuff because I'm allergic to mold. It's one of my allergies. Uh, it's dried up right now. It's not bad. But when it was like wet and damp, I can't go near this stuff. Because I get sick really bad. And I got sick on Sunday, which I stayed home and didn't go to church that day because I just wasn't feeling very well. Um, see right here? It just looks bad. That's why I wanted to show you at this time what damage um, this bad boy right here did. It just caused a lot of damage around this area. Anyway, that's why I wanted to show you. It's just going to take a lot of time and money in order to get this fixed and taken care of. Until the next video, everyone, you take care and have a good day. We'll see you next time.